see, that's something that, ki that kind of intrigues me, because Patchouli mentioned at least three other people, which means there's four total. Now, of the four, there's Patchouli and Alice. And I know Marissa has, like, a freaking huge harem, but I'm not really sure who this game specifically is referring to. I guess Neatery was one of the remaining ones, but who's the last one, then? Renosuke, I guess? Reimu. Huh. Don't take money with you. I don't think she ever buys anything. now realize she doesn't have legs. Yeah, that was a pretty nasty looking little head. Why Nidori has been acting so scared recently, though. Hmm. <laughs> Be quiet, Mima. So technology is going to connect interdimensional portals? That's some nifty technology. Heck yeah, Pacholi! Okay, now I was curious last time they said a they said a line like that, but this time I'm quite I'm quite positive that's a reference to Phoenix Wright. She landed anyway. There was the big explosion, and then everything was cold. Because Marissa is merely a human with the occupation of magician. Pacholi, her species, is magician. I don't want to hear that before you shoot me somewhere. Yeah, that wasn't very impressive. It was just a black scrolling. Well, this is... This is Tengu Mountain. Hey, where is everybody?
Oh, there's somebody. What's up? So everybody else is gone. Well, I guess that would explain why Nidori's been feel- Oh, come on! Hurrah! So I guess the Tengus moved to the new human city? Hmm. Oh, even the Hotel for Two's closed. I am saddened. Everything is gone. Wait, can I squeeze through here? Anything up here? No, darn it. Well, I don't know where we're supposed to go, but, uh... Can I go in here? But I want to go in there. Guess we're climbing us a mountain again. He's not even remotely trying to attack me. I guess this is how S dealt with the, um... In Earthbound, normally, once you get an, a high enough level over the enemies, the enemies actually run away from you. They don't go out of their way to attack you anymore. So I guess this is his way of kind of dealing with that, since these are all really weak enemies. That's kind of neat. Not really sure where I'm going, though. Oh wait, there's two ropes here. Let's see, I went up this one. Well, they're not gonna let me up it again, so I guess we're going up this one. Yep, here we are, brand new area. What's up, buddy? Same enemies as before. The, uh, big squirrel. Oh, crap, he's fast. Okay, the previous fight was the big colorful square dude with a bunch of electro dudes. That dude was a bunch of buckets and a bunch of electrodes. Heck yeah! Can't I have my yellow submarine? I like my yellow submarine. For those curious, we are essentially crossing the Sanzu River. I think that's pronounced the Sanzu River anyway. It's the river connecting life to the afterlife. 